My name is Tamika Ketchings, and I'm a forward for the USA Women's National Basketball Team. I've had the opportunity to represent my country three times and win three gold medals. And I play in the WNBA for the Indiana Fever. My father actually played in the NBA for 11 years, so we traveled around a lot. At that point in time, I wanted to play soccer and softball. Those were my first two sports. And then I started playing basketball when I was in third grade. When I started playing basketball, it actually wasn't a league for girls. So my sister and I played on an all-boys team, and my dad was the coach. I would have to say that I was definitely one of those players that was eager for my coach to teach me. Sports, to me, was an outlet. You know, I grew up with a hearing problem and a speech problem. Sports was a way that I could practice and I could get really, really good at something. Being in the gym, my own world, where nobody could mess with me, nobody could say anything bad to me. It's not just about winning and losing. My dad always talked about the number one thing is I want you to have fun and I want you to work hard. So whether you're the best player or the worst player, you still get an opportunity to play. It's great that USA Basketball has teamed up with all the other professional leagues and now, you know, we're trying to put together an initiative where we can go out and we can focus on the basic skills of the game. From ball handling to shooting, passing, defense, being a great team player. I think it's really important to be able to teach the skills young because as you get older, you see a lot of dunking and all these spectacular moves and stuff. You know, it's really important to learn the basics of the game of basketball. It's really important for coaches to get certified. And the coaches, you're there to help teach them, but encourage them and not just focus on playing to win all the time. How I feel about the game of basketball is going to be based on how much they teach me, how much they encourage me, and just how much they motivate me and inspire me. Because I had great coaches along the way and every step, it kept the fire burning inside of me. Make them dribble the ball. Don't be afraid. That's what coaches are there for. They're there to teach you first, but you know, encourage you and, and motivate you. And I think the more you have that as a coach and the energy that you have is the energy that you put inside those kids. So if you're passionate and you love it and you can teach the basic skills, you put that inside of a child that continues to grow and they grow the same love that you have for the game. And even now, I'm passionate about what I do. The way I play is the way that I played when I was younger. And I just love the game of basketball.